Nothing says I'm a human like wearing pants, but pants change. And where are they going next? I'm Rhett, and I know the future. It's the future, according to Rhett. Rhett. On YouTube, Megajet Jaguar asks, will parachute pants ever come back into style? Greetings, Megajet Jaguar. Your username reminds me of something that will be invented in the year 2143. Your question about parachute pants is much too simple for me, however. So I've decided to do you one better and tell you about the future of pants in general. But before we step into the future of pants, let's iron out the history of pants. Trousers were originally designed for horseback riding. This intrigues me personally because I've always found it most efficient to ride a horse while in a Speedo. When it became generally acceptable for women to wear pants in the 1970s, all hell broke loose. The first thing they did was decide to expand the bottom into a bell shape and tighten the crotch area. For reasons unknown, men started wearing these pants too. In the 80s, people grew tired of the bell bottom and tightened the leg opening, resulting in pants that were tight in the crotch, through the leg, and at the bottom, and cut off circulation to people's feet. Something had to give, and something did. The crotch. In the early 90s, thanks in large part to MC Hammer, the crotch area became offensively bloated, but the leg opening remained annoyingly small, resulting in the parachute pant. Here's a fun fact. Everyone who ever tried to use parachute pants as an actual parachute died. Realizing parachute pants were ridiculous, members of skater, goth, and hip-hop cultures let the bottom out, resulting in huge wide-legged pants that were so large you could hide small children or animals in them, though this was rarely done. The new millennium led to a recentering of pants as the top and bottom sprang back to close to normal, with the leg opening remaining slightly relaxed. This was called the boot cut, but in an embrace of post-modernity, lots of people wore them without boots. More recently, hipsters have taken control of jean fashion, and we've returned to the 80s shape, offensively tight crotches, legs, and bottoms. But what about the future of pants? Something has to give, and it won't be the crotch. It won't even be the bottom. It'll be the middle, the knee. The knee will give. The pant will look like a snake that has just eaten an antelope. They'll be called snake pants. Soon, women will be seen wearing snake pants, and other women will tell them they look fabulous in them. Men will think they look ridiculous, but will say nothing. That's the future of pants. Until the future, my friends. Ask Rhett your questions about the future in the comments below, on Facebook, or at RhettMC on Twitter. Please note that Rhett is not responsible for any spontaneity that is removed from your life because of the extreme accuracy of his predictions.